This is surveillance video that captures the moment of the explosion early Monday morning. Someone ignited the crescent symbol in front of the Masjid Fatima Al Zahara Mosque in Ronkonkoma, an act being investigated as a hate crime. Behind that second window over there, a big explosion. And I assume that it is 4th of July. Ahmed Ibrahim is the imam of the mosque. Then I felt a big light behind me. So I turned around, I found the Christians in flame. We heard like a big bang. So we looked over and the moon was like on fire. A man who lives nearby but didn't want his face on camera then came running over and used this stick to help put out the flames. We were like, well, how did that happen? We were just, there was nobody around. You know, so when we turned around, we saw it was on fire. It was like crazy. And this is the crescent moon outside of the mosque here. And as you can see here, it's actually on top of a rather steep hill that goes down to Lakeshore Drive. So it wouldn't necessarily be easy for someone driving by to have tossed this device. And it was a freestanding sign on the top of a hill. So an individual would have to, uh, you know, walk up the hill and specifically set. Uh, the device uh, against the sign. The surveillance video at one point shows two people on the sidewalk and a flash that looks like someone running away. The mosque opened up three years ago and the founder tells PIX11 News that nothing like this has ever happened before. We don't have place for hate like that. We don't have place for you. And the imam has this question for the suspect or suspects. We are part of the fabric of America. What do you want to say to me by exploding something into my symbol of Islam? Why? And police, of course, want to know that same answer. They're looking not only at the surveillance video that we showed you there, but they say they have other surveillance video, and they're looking to see who is responsible. We are live here in Ronkonkoma. Eileen LaPalmer, PIX11 News.